Hey guys and girls, this is Alish from GainMediaLab.com. Welcome to my exciting world of live audio mixing. In today's episode, we talk about how to wrap a microphone cable around a microphone stand and why you should absolutely care. Let's go. This seems like an episode that doesn't really need to be made. I mean, you have a mic cable, you have a microphone on a stand, you plug it in, Bob's your uncle, how hard can it be? Actually, you should make it neat. Not only because everybody's recording video of their concerts nowadays, and you definitely don't want to be the guy that has a messy stage, but also because of safety's sake. If the cables are not stored properly, if they are not mounted correctly, somebody might trip over them, and you have a lawsuit on your hands in the worst case scenario and just an inconvenience in the best case scenario. However, there's a third reason why you should absolutely care how your mic cable is wrapped around your stand, and that is efficiency. Mic cables break down. And this is why you should make your stage neat, because if you have to replace a microphone cable, then you should do that efficiently and quickly. There's nothing worse than a sound engineer on stage is trying to fiddle with the cables while everybody is watching you. Trust me, you can feel everybody's eyesight on your back while you're doing that. There are two extremes here that you should probably avoid. One is just having the cable hang from the microphone, making it easy for somebody to either trip over it or catch something on it, uh, breaking the microphone cable at best and breaking the microphone at worst. So you should avoid that. The second one goes into the opposite extreme. You would have a very diligent stagehand that would wrap the microphone cable around the stand very, very tightly, basically making it very neat, but at the same time impossible to exchange. And it's very irritating for the artist if they want to grab a microphone in their own hands and uh, maybe walk around the stage a bit. It turns into a nightmare and they have a lot of work with that, so try to avoid that scenario as well. Here's a technique that works really well for me. It sort of ticks all boxes. It is neat, it allows for quick uh, cable exchange in case of an emergency, and it also provides the artist with the ability to grab the microphone into their own hand and walk the stage without getting caught up with all the cables and microphone stands. Here's how it works. Place the coiled microphone cable on the floor next to the mic stand. Now take the XLR female connector and plug it into the microphone. Let the mic cable fall down on the side where you can find the boom tensioning screw of your microphone stand. Then simply take the microphone cable, run it behind the microphone stand and sort of tuck it behind that same boom tensioning screw. This makes the microphone cable very neat looking on the stand and yet it allows for a simple unhook with one hand making the mic cable free of the stand, allowing the artist to walk the stage or for you to change the mic cable very quickly if you have to. That's it, that's the technique, and that's all for this episode. Now, if you have a better way of securing the mic cable to your mic stand, please let me know in the comments below. Um, while you're doing that, you can like and subscribe and share and all of the good stuff, and also go to gainmedialab.com uh, to find more delicious content. Take care, mix great shows, bye.